what we also find as well is a lot of rumination. It's one of the questions came up when I put up the poll about rumination. Now, what rumination is, is we think about the same thing over and over again. And the reason for that is a lot of different reasons, but I think the biggest reason is we don't like things that don't make sense. Our brains aren't hardwired to sit with uncomfortable things. We are probably the only creature on this planet that needs to know things we don't know. We need to know what to do whenever we don't know what to do. It doesn't sit well with us. So if you imagine you're in a situation with someone that could have been maybe a sibling, a parent, a partner, it could be someone that you trusted, someone that you loved, someone that was supposed to have your back. But they were they were selfish, they were judgmental, they were critical, they didn't show any kind of compassion. Well, that doesn't make sense to us, especially if we have invested so much of us into them and it was never enough. So what we do is we ruminate, we think about almost all of those interactions. They keep coming back. We think about the birthday, we think about the special occasion, we, we think about the time we sacrificed, the time that we compromised, but we got little back in return. Yeah, we think about all of those interactions. We think about how much it hurt. We think about the things that we might have been able to do differently. We think about why the hell did they do that? Why would someone behave like that? We almost try to go into their head, trying to think of their motivations, trying to think of, you know, what were their motives? We don't like things that don't make sense. Now, the other side of that is if there is still contact and maybe we have to see them, maybe we have to res respond to a text or an email, we have to meet up with them, we have to do whatever, they're going to be in the situation or the environment that we're going to be in. Um, we start to analyze what could happen. What are they going to do? How are they going to hurt me? So we're almost like safety planning and we're thinking ahead. We're expecting something and whatever it is, we're trying to avoid that. So we keep on ruminating, thinking about the same things over and over again. Another reason we can be stuck is blame. Now, as much as we know that her person hurt us, as much as we have a good idea of their character and the way they behaved, for some people, they actually blame themselves. I maybe should have done this. I should have done that. I should have said the other thing. A common thing, you may have said this yourself, I've said it myself, a lot of comments on the channels, a lot of different uh, people comment on many different things. Why didn't I see the red flags? So there's a little bit of blame there as well. Why did I not see this coming? When the truth is, you know, when it comes to red flags, it's not like they were waving them in front of you saying, hooray, look at what I'm doing. A lot of the time they're little, small, subtle things. They're little pieces at a time. It's a small kind of erosion, a little piece at a time. So we don't really see them until we're in the middle of it, but there is still that kind of blame that goes on, not just blame for them, but the blame that we sometimes feel towards ourselves for not doing this, for not saying that, for being in that position in the first place. So what we do is we start thinking about, well, what if this had have been different? Or what if I had tried that little bit harder? Or what if I had given them what they had wanted? So again, it's a form of rumination, but it's almost like we're trying to rewrite what happened as if we could have done it better. If it's a relationship that was difficult, there may be that part of us that's thinking, maybe they have changed. Well, it's not for me to say they would or they wouldn't. Again, if it's narcissism, it's not likely. Um, I think sometimes what we see is a change in tactic or a change in strategy, sometimes to do the same thing. And any change may be short-lived before they just go back to doing what they're doing again. So we're kind of back where we started.